And unless you were below like 120 pounds, that's why the girls kept getting knocked out. Like, it was perfect. So, Tommy, we want to say thank you. Was that the same version that you went down in a flattering singlet? Unitard? I wanted to make it. I want to get it. Yeah. What was that? I was, I was coming up a little short on the second gap, and I just I wanted more speed, and that was not Judging it. Judging by the size of what was in that Unitard, you are coming up a little short more than the second gap. Just The water was cold. The water. Crashes only happen when people are trying to progress, attempting to do something that most would consider to be unwise. Mountain bikers may be classified in two categories, ones that have crashed and ones that have crashed a lot. in the KTM tent. Next to me you can see Ronnie Renner. He's a pussy. <laughs> the Nitro crew has traveled a bit with the common language of motorcycles as their chosen dialect. Borders have been crossed, races have been raced, and cultures have been experienced. There they go. And yeast infections have been known to happen. Travis has put a little bit of weight on, but... <laughs> smarter than that. Back in 95 when this was new I guess I didn't have a clue Thought the world would change the right song
tell you. You ready? Yeah. Oh! 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 Well, there was oh, nothing really to do. It was either him or me. I mean, this was a fight for survival here in the jungles of Costa Rica. Any real food this time? Everything's no one, closed. Nothing's open. I'm sorry, Dude, man. <laughs> I'm serious, man. I'm not going to make it on cookies and tacos. See. I may be second worst rider in this race but there is one below me street bike tommy hey tom tommy what day is this in this uh, six day enduro it's about three quarter three quarter <laughs> no no what day yeah three quarter of the first day <laughs> okay oh my goodness so the plot thickens so i go back down and like go back down this trail which is really easy it's all like worn down and like <laughs> I pull in and say, hey guys, um, how'd you guys get here? And they like, Bushy Glocken, Bushy Glocken Glocken. And I'm like, oh no, I forgot. I told him, I didn't, I, I didn't realize that they wouldn't be able to speak any English whatsoever. <laughs> they heard of them. I like, I'm like, how like, could they? You sons of bitches. We're, we're, we're a major world power. <laughs> I think it's about three in the morning, and I've been sleeping in a hole. <laughs> We're in the Romanian mountains. To Tommy has gone through full body seizure lock. No, I'm like 20, 25 feet away from you guys. No, like I'm like all of a sudden I'm sleeping, and all of a sudden I was like. I thought you were getting eaten by a bear. I seriously did. So 200 more to go, and I'm just getting an extra kick to get me there. I just rode 26 hours straight, only to go handlebar deep in some silt and have my bike cut out about two hours from the finish. I know two hours sounds like a long time, but after you run 26 straight, two hours is right there. Out of the 20 iron riders that started in Ensenada, none of them had reached the checkered flag by nightfall. At the 40th hour of the race, that all changed. Greg rode into the finish, becoming the first solo rider to complete the 1300 mile course in 40 hours, four minutes, and 12 seconds. You are the Iron Rider, <laughs> let me tell you. <laughs> Trap, why is it every 4th of July yep. you have a Roman candle aimed at one of us? Roman oh, candle, oh. that's an understatement. <laughs> Thousands of tons of ammunition here, and they're going to battle until somebody gets their ass burned off. Got some swarming skaters, I got some big explosions, I got some untamed retribution, and I got 500 grams of power over here. That's, that's gonna... nice, what do you got? I got you it. ain't got nothing. It's on Ooh. and popping tonight here, baby. <laughs> Josh Lichtel comes. <laughs> oh, 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 a mortar. Boom! Oh, yeah, oh, it hit him so hard, it, it, he oh. was on the ground screaming bloody murder. That was bad. Well. How did that not kill him? I don't know. He had a big old imprint of oh, whatever it was, it was that cute. smoked his head. Don't play with fireworks. Listen to your parents. And don't hang out with Travis. This is what happens. You hit in the head. <laughs> Who starts the firework fights? Generally, it's this guy. <laughs> <laughs> Him. I see.
fucking like Vietnam going on. <laughs> Stuff's going on fire. <laughs> What's going on? He's wrecking you like fire, man. You are a fire. Uh, that was one of your epic dances in those cowboy boots, what you tight. It was. Tell it. it was. <laughs>